the first process is plan risk management let's start with the overview it's the process of defining how to conduct risk management activities what templates to be used who should get involved and what tools and techniques will work well for this project the project manager sponsor team customer other stakeholders and of course experts may be involved in the plan risk management process they define how risk management will be structured and performed for the project in fact as a part of the planning the potential areas of risk in the project are identified by the project participants this process also identifies who will be involved and how the team will go about performing risk management the key benefit of this process is that it gives clarity on degree type and visibility of risk management to stakeholders when to do it the planned risk management process should begin when the project is conceived and should be completed as early as possible in the project and of course it's an iterative process and should be performed once or at predefined points in the project it may be necessary to revisit this process later in the project life cycle for example at a major phase change or if the project scope changes significantly or if a subsequent review determines that risk management effectiveness requires modification all right that's a quick overview let's jump into the ittwos